I started a conversation about female genital masturbation, not mutilation as that is cruel and distressing, whereas self-pleasure is surely one of the best things. Let's stay on titillation, titivation, and I will start on a, with a monologue on my sexual awakening, experiential if no longer confidential. Yes, women wank too. Thank you for being interested. My guess is you've not discussed it before. I know some people think it's disgusting, yet I do enjoy some taboo busting. When I was younger, I tried a banana, then a cucumber. Of course, they went soft down under. And whilst these weren't the right kind of plants to plant in my jade garden, I beg my own pardon. As a pre-teenager, I couldn't access a vibrator. I'm 50, you just couldn't buy them then. On the internet. I wonder if my daughter has bought a stimulator off the internet yet. I bet she wouldn't mind. She, she wouldn't want me asking. I know she's seen mine, and if she want, want, wants one, then that's fine. Boys have their hands, and they might not understand that an early teenage girl gives other tools a whirl against her clitoral curl, or to reach into her cave and she thinks she misbehaves. She can feel ashamed of playing perverted games, yet aren't we all the same, same at heart, same within? And although morals and religion can get in the way of enjoying the best foreplay, or the one-player games that we do all play, and did you dry hump with your brother? Because that's another game that's not allowed, frowned upon, yet we were just playful. Pre-teens located for what seemed like ages, abroad and bored without other playmates. My dad lived in Thailand and we, were, we, just, we just didn't have anybody to play with for six weeks. <laughs> nothing, nothing bad happened. Um, so we kind of had our own dates. Honestly, who's not messed about with their siblings? <laughs> so we were just trying out some adult, adult things. We were like ten. Now I have a powerful vibrator, a clitoral stimulator that pulses and is programmable. And whilst too big to be rammable, it's sensual, rechargeable, really cool. Branded emotional bliss, it brings me off so quick, I recommend it highly. It's not that shoddy overpriced sex, high street sex toy tact. How do they get away with that faulty dildo crap? With my clit and sacred G-spot inside and out, I've got at least three love buttons. Too many for just my own hands. So I'm looking for another, a two-way interaction in our love action, as the chemical reaction is a richer intoxicant. Love's lubricant is pleasure, and whatever turns you on, that is where you belong.